Hi, I'm Alex Marshall, and I'm a co-director of the Health Promotion and Prevention Research PhD program. My research agenda largely focuses on addressing adolescent sexual health. I have developed expertise in conducting research and promoting health among sexual and gender minority groups, paying particular attention to transgender folks. I've also conducted a lot of HIV prevention and sexual health education research. If you're interested in learning more about what other faculty members are doing, I'd encourage you to check out the profiles available on our website. What does health promotion and prevention research mean to me? Well, I think in terms of the work I do, I am doing health promotion when I am developing and delivering educational activities. These things are usually related to uh, teaching people about LGBTQ health or gender affirming care, but they're also sometimes related to promoting HIV prevention or teen pregnancy prevention. I also conduct prevention research uh, when I'm targeting health disparities affecting LGBTQ folks with community member involvement and when I'm doing research addressing sexual and gender related health outcomes. What are some projects previous students have completed in the program? Thinking about previous dissertations, uh, I've had one student who assessed the facilitators and barriers to implementing a suicide prevention model in an emergency department. I had another student who interviewed African American teenage girls uh, to collect their opinions about a teen pregnancy prevention program. And I had another student who assessed the feasibility of implementing an adverse childhood events questionnaire in a group of women's clinics. And I have also had a student who interviewed women who had been recently released from a criminal justice setting and had a history of substance use and uh, asked them about their attitudes towards developing a trauma-informed yoga intervention to assist with their reentry and recovery. So as you can see, there's a wide variety of projects that have been completed by our students. What do I hope students will take away from this PhD program? Well, I hope graduates feel equipped to work with communities, to assess their needs, to identify and to prioritize their health concerns. And I hope they feel competent in their ability to develop and implement and test interventions that can change behaviors and improve health outcomes. And whether students prefer qualitative or quantitative data collection, I hope they feel confident in their ability to generate data-driven solutions to health issues that are identified. If any of what I've said so far interests you, I hope you will check out our website and look at our admissions criteria. Keep in mind that uh, deadline for applications is January 15th of each year. We make our admissions decisions in the spring and allow our students who are newly admitted to begin in the following fall term. So please contact me with any questions you have and I look forward to hearing from you.